back in the office. <laughs> All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Yeah. Game that has no. When Stanley came to a set Then you're making hair doors, choice. He I suppose that's true. I did make hair choice that time. <laughs> uh, you you see you, you basically have no you have no decisions in this. There's no way. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Closed. Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley um. walked upstairs to his boss's office. Oh, it's but Stanley this one again. just couldn't do it. He considered the possibility of... Let's quit that. Start again. I've done that one. This is the story of a man named Stan. So have we have we done everything on the left hand All side? All his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided you to go use to the, the photocopy. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Really? I can't. When okay. Stanley came to a set of two, so we've done everything. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. <laughs> we've done everything on the left. By the employee lounge first, just to admire it. The lounge was sublime, a work of art. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first. We've gone straight on, on here, left. so let's go left. And so he detoured through the maintenance section. Walk straight ahead to the opposite door and got back on track. Or we go here instead. The closet is still blocked off. But Stanley didn't want to go Nothing I can do about office. it. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. He's just been to it. So now, in order to get back, he needed to go. Um. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> here it's um left. Okay. Oh no, no, it's to the right. My mistake. <laughs> Can we still go left? No. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have <laughs> ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? It's clearly. Oh dear! Would you hold on for a minute, please? <laughs> now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right. Yep, yep, okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. Okay. This story, he says. No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. A spo Quick, Stanley, close your I've already eyes. been here. Okay. Just, we just have to get back to, um, oh, who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, <laughs> hmm? Okay, from the top. <laughs> so that was the, 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 the... The failed ending All of was his it? His co-workers were gone. <laughs> what could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Okay. When wait. Stanley, wait, wait, what? Wait, what? No, I'm... no, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over, completely fresh. Everything should be. Oh, did something change, Stanley? Did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you move the story somewhere or a... Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here <laughs> just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay then. It's an adventure. 
Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Oh. Um. Okay. Um. We gotta find a story. Adventure time. There's too many decisions in this. There's too many ways to go. I'm 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 out of my depth. Oh my god, this it's too overwhelming. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can <laughs> promise you there definitely was a story here before. Do we just do we need to restart the game again? Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again, but it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why not? I can't do it. <gasps> All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Okay, yep, it's worse. <laughs> I'm remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? Okay. Um. Aha! I knew we missed <laughs> something. The story. Here it comes. <laughs> No, wait, never oh. mind. Not the story. <laughs> okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our steps. Um, okay. <laughs> um, now where no, the hell are we? Well, I'll be honest, I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? <laughs> I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It, is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? Well, do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Congratulations! Yay! I know you put in a lot of hard work Yay! and you really paid off, so good job. Yay! Oh, no, no I don't feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Aww. Okay, I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what the GTs in the time, chat. I have to restart. <laughs> Aww. The Stanley Parable Adventure Line. <laughs> okay. All right, I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure TM. Line. Just follow the line. <laughs> How simple is that? I mean, this is the same. Oh, oh, we're going in here now. But what if we go here? Ah. No, no, I'm down. We're leaving it up to the line from now on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we're leaving it up to the line, are we? Poo pooed with a one dollar now. This is how this is a story all about how I became the prince of a town called Bella. <laughs> Oops, wrong story. Sorry, Stan. <laughs> Thank you, Poo Pooed. Solitaire on that computer there. Okay, let's 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 follow the line. You see? The line knows where the story is. I like how it goes around the brook. direction. Box. Onward the Stanley next up to box. destiny. Nope. Here. Here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, <laughs> is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Please walk in a circle. Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. We did. Now, we can both agree that the nature of existence is, in fact, a byproduct of one subjective experience of that existence, right? Okay. Now, if my line's getting a bit wonky. Of existence rests inside of your subjective line's getting a bit experience weird. of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. 
Well, I'd like to apologize. I'm not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. We're counting down. Yay! Aw, oh, we didn't get to go to one. The line is getting crazy. Leo speed Leo with a one dollar. Maybe if we follow the secret line we will get our <laughs> our pets back. Oh my god. <laughs> We're back in room six again. Wait, what? Wait, have I gone have I gone wrong? I've done, I've, done, I've done. Wait, what? Did I accidentally go back on myself? How did I manage to do that? How did I manage to go back on my. I don't know. Okay, nothing, nothing. Else. Couldn't even follow a line. God damn it! <laughs> Couldn't even follow a line! <laughs> oh, that's an ultimate choke, that one. Jesus, Wait, couldn't even follow a line. Go back and look at that fern. Okay. Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. Okay. <laughs> Like Wait, sends us we're back at the office? No, no, no. Line, you do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? Come on, Line. Be better. <laughs> We've done all that. We could have just gone through here. And I can't... He's leaving it up to the line. I'm not sure about this. Wait. Oh, no. No, oh. no, not again, Line. How Come could you on, Line. To us? And after we trusted you, after everything we've been through, you. Oh, I can't take this anymore. To hell with it. Restart. <laughs> this game, man. Okay, the you adventure. Know what, Stanley, I say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. Oh, this all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in... Well, I don't know. How about this direction? Oh, this direction. Okay, let's do it. I'm up for it. I'm up for it, Mr. Now, Narrator Man. Yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you yeah. want our story to be? Go wild. Wait, I Use feel like I'm your going imagination. In okay. Whatever it might be. Yum. I'm ready for it. Hero got with the donation. The line seems to have a high ceiling. Traction loss oh, stat. No, not you again. <gasps> oh, the Stand line's it. broken in. I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No <laughs> lines or monitor rooms. Just don't <laughs> acknowledge it. And we should be fine. It TM. <laughs> Thanks, Hero Go for the donation, man. Oh my god. Ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. How Yay. important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay, <laughs> so I know that each door has to lead somewhere. <laughs> Which means that somewhere, the place oh where God. we're trying to go, there must be a reverse. The line is out of line. Leads here, and that in turn you had one job means line. that our destination like the TM in the corresponds chat. with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. So, starting from the right, let us ask: Will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. Okay. Can we open this one anyway? No. Okay. The confusion ending. Oh, oh 
Hold up, what's this? Hmm. Hmm. You've been playing the confusion ending for 16 ending. minutes. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant ending? And we're supposed to restart the game what, eight, eight times? <laughs> that's really how all this goes? It's all determined? So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this this thing. Find the confusing ending schedule and well, the restarts the game since restart. Me. Why don't I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? After a long time, Stanley dies. No, it can't be. I don't, <laughs> I don't want it to be. I, I oh my god, we're only halfway through. I don't want to forget what's going on. I don't want to be trapped like this. The doors were going to send me in the same the place anyway. Do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. And the timer stopped. Does that mean um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The um whatever it is that made this schedule. How would we even know? Will someone come for us? Will something happen? <laughs> so um. okay. I guess now we just wait, you know. I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story, wouldn't you agree? I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. <laughs> well, in the meantime... If... Oh! <laughs> Wait, that said the the narrator forgets about the previous restarts. All of his co-workers were gone. And then it says what that I'm not going to be able to play the game or something. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Are we still on the confusion ending? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just, so just meta. to admire it. Stanley in this incredible room, Stanley for the first time... Jack with the one dollar kit, we have to go back. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took Thank the first for the donation. door on his left. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Oh, was that it? Was that the ending? Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. Oh. I realize that investing in your trust in someone... But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. <laughs> Damn it! All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oh, man. I mean, the, the signs in that room did tell me about that, to be fair. Wait, what? This is different. When Stanley came to a set of different? two open doors, he entered the door on his left. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. So was that the death that was the in the confusion Stanley ending, and you made it all by yourself? In his stomach, <laughs> Maybe. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Stanley, with the one dollar, God, just stop and quit this game and stop abusing me and let me play GTA. I mean, it did say that it would cause death. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot. There's a door down there. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your Thank you for the donation, whoever that was. Difficult. But the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting. We've already been through there. Someone you've forgotten about. Please, stop trying to make everything. What if we don't answer the phone? Now, I'm not asking for me. 
I'm asking for her. This is it, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself. To put your work aside. To let her back into your life. She's been waiting. That's her, Stanley. What if we, you like, unplug it? One. Oh, no, oh. no, 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 you can't. Did you just unplug the phone? Um. Now, that wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? You actually chose incorrectly. I didn't even know that was possible. Let me double check. <laughs> no, it's definitely here, clear as day. Stanley picks up the phone. He's taken to his apartment where he finds his wife, and the two pledge themselves to one another. Music comes in, fade to white, roll credits. That is not what happens, you liar. It's actually somehow an incorrect course of action. How is that even possible? None of these decisions were supposed to mean anything. I don't understand. How on earth are you making meaningful choices? What did you... Wait a second. Did I just see... No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. How had I not noticed it sooner? You're not Stanley. You're a real person. <sighs> I can't believe I was so mistaken. This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices. And to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. If you've made any more wrong choices, you might have negated it entirely. It's as though you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol for real-world decision-making. Or did you not grasp the severity of the situation? Well, I won't have that kind of risk on my watch. I'm going to stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly on safe decision making in the real world. Please <laughs> observe this helpful instructional video. Choice. It's the best part of being a real person. But if used incorrectly, it can also be the most dangerous. Oh my for god, example, this fourth wall break. In this break. scenario, a hypothetical real person named Stephen has a choice. He could spend years helping improve the quality of life for citizens of impoverished third world nations. Or he could systematically set fire to every orphan living in a 30 kilometer radius of his house. <laughs> Which choice would you make? Remember that unlike here, the real world makes sense. And at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. If you find yourself speaking with a person <laughs> who does not make sense, in all likelihood, that person is not real. Allow the person to finish their thought, then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, <laughs> My goodness, is it 4.30? I'm supposed to be having a back sack and crack. <laughs> what? Excellent. Making choices on a regular basis is the best part to a healthy decision-making process. Most medical professionals recommend making at least eight choices per day. Do you make more than eight? Less? And finally, if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution to the world, just remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially insignificant and the feeling should <laughs> subside. At this time, your instructor will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. Ah, welcome back. You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of narrative contradiction. But not to worry. Now that you're properly informed on good decision making, we're going to revisit a choice you made just a few minutes ago and see what the correct thing to do would have been. This way, please. Me. Unplugging the, the phone has led to this because of my bad decision making. <laughs> now that we know your choices are meaningful, we can't have you jumping off the platform and dying. Imagine the main character dying senselessly halfway through the story. That story would make no sense at all. We just need to get you home as soon as possible before the narrative contradiction gets any worse. Unfortunately, it seems this place is not well equipped to deal with reality. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> We're going backwards. Almost there. You'll take the door on the left, 
Back to the correct ending, the story will have resolution once again, and you'll be home free in the real world. <laughs> now remember, all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. <laughs> no! Why did you do that? <laughs> Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps we're Look not too it. late. <laughs> We're messing up the game with our terrible choices. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh, it's ruined. You, I can't believe after everything we talked about that you. My story. You've destroyed my work. Why? For what? What did you get out of that? What did you think was so special about seeing the game undone? Left here like so much garbage. Is that a red it, dot? It, it's worthless now. And what am I supposed to do? Even if there were a way to continue, would it be worth it? To know that my story is now incorrect? How can I go back to that? I can't erase that knowledge. I'll have to live with it forever. Reliving its impossibility forever. Oh, I couldn't <laughs> live that way. Is it better to shut the game down entirely? To willingly destroy all of my work? I don't know. What's the answer? What do I do? What do I do? What do I... No, I have to. I have to shut the game down. I have to. I have to. <laughs> Okay. Oh. oh I'm, I'm here. I'm still here. Here in this pile of rubbish. With you. You. <laughs> who thought you were so clever. Now <laughs> look where we are. My entire game is destroyed. It was the only thing in the world that was mine and you've run it into the ground. <laughs> what, did you think that would be funny? You just had to see? Didn't I impress upon you how important it was to be like Stanley? He actually knows how to do what I tell him to. He understands that if I say to do something, there's a damn good reason for it. That thought hadn't even occurred to you, had it? <laughs> that there's a world outside of you? You're a child. Oh, my story. <laughs> If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was We've a already seen it. Facility. You would have destroyed it and been victorious. It would We've have been so it. perfect. I worked so hard on it. I tried so hard. <laughs> it's behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly <laughs> and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. <laughs> no! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry! Wait. <laughs> His behave exactly as Stanley would. <laughs> that means choosing responsibly no, and always triggered. putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. <laughs> no! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry! <laughs> behave exactly as Stanley. I don't know why I find this so funny. ...and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. Oh All my right. God. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open okay, doors... I'm doing it one more time and then, the then we'll do it left. the proper way. <laughs> no! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry... It get it, it breaks His exactly quicker as every Stanley single time. I feel like just continuing. Responsibly ...and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the <laughs> task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> <laughs> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. <laughs> no! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry!
Okay, that was the same time. I'll, I'll go left now. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. <laughs> oh man, having too much fun with this. Putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the oh, task. Man. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, <laughs> he entered the door on his left. All right, we'll do it properly this time. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave oh, of disbelief, man. Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Oh, room office closet, we can get in it this time. An there. Oh, no, we can't. It's, it's locked. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Doesn't say executive bathroom on this anymore. Something is not right. Oh. This is definitely Standing different. inside his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this until he saw the door with a voice receiver next to it. Surely behind this door lay all the answers to his questions. And beyond all probability, he knew the passcode. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Night Shark 115. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one way to find out. Stanley had been trained never to speak up, but now he would <laughs> draw from within himself the courage to face the unknown. He drew a sharp breath and then spoke the code. <laughs> it doesn't work. <clears throat> Stanley spoke the code. Night Shark 115. He spoke it into the receiver right there on the wall. It doesn't work. Wait, do I have to speak it? I'm sorry, is there a problem? You didn't miss him. No. Anymore. Please speak the code into the receiver. Otherwise, we can't get on with the story. This no. Is a crucial step. Night Shark 115. Okay, fine. You're not going to do it, but you know what? It's okay, fine. No, I, I thought it, this far. it wasn't that much. suddenly decide you have better things to do, I ask you for this one single thing for your respect. The kind of respect Stanley shows for his choices. He knows what it means to take a story seriously. If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? You had a choice, you know. You could have gone through the door on the right. You could have done whatever the hell you wanted over there. Why did you come this way? Speak. Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. <laughs> uh oh. When he came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. What? Stanley? Hello? Are you. Is everything okay? Stanley, please. I, I need you to make a choice. <laughs> the end. You walk through the door. Are you listening to me? Can you hear me? Is everything all right? Stanley, this is important. We got credits. The story needs you. It needs you to make a decision. It cannot exist without you. Do you understand me? Whatever choice you make is just fine. They're both correct. You can't be wrong here. We can work together. I'll accept whatever you do. I simply need you to take that step forward, please. Choose. Did we actually make it to the true ending? Anything. This is more important than you can ever know. I need this. The story needs it. So, you hear me? Are you there? Are you listening to this? Danny, are you there? I like how the narrator's pleading with him to to get back and 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 get back into the game. Otherwise, like it makes sense. That's all right. I'll wait for you to decide what's the right thing to do. Oh, he's so sad. Take as much time as you need. He's so sad. The narrator's so sad. And then we're back again because the the game never ends and the narrator would be sad if we were to leave the game completely even now stanley's office was a distant